वेलकम टू द रॉयल कैलकुलेटर टर्फ क्लब कैलकुलेटर रेसेस मॉनसून मीटिंग फिफ्थ डे थर्सडे 26 अक्टूबर 2023 रेस प्रीव्यू फॉर द डार्बी डे फर्स्ट रेस ऑफ द आफ्टरनून इज द बेड ब्रेक 7 विन योर लक हैंडीकैप फॉर हॉर्सेस रेटेड 1 टू 26 टू बी रन ओवर अ डिस्टेंस ऑफ 1100 मीटर्स फर्स्ट वन आई वी आर लुकिंग एट इज एक्स्ट्रावेगन स्टार एस अ पुट आउट ऑफ अफ्रीकन स्काई Written by Kuldeep Singh, trained by Rathav Walford. Couple of starts for Extravagant Star in the season. First up in race number four, it finished on fourth behind Dance Along. In his next start in race number nine, the one we are looking at, it went over 1200 meters. Was in forward position into the last 200, then was overhauled by UV and eventually finished on third. Number two is Jin Suku, who's had three starts in the short season. First up in race number one, it finished on fifth behind Lion Queen. Then it finished on fifth again behind Jawa in race number eight. The run we are looking at is from race number nineteen, where it was in second spot as they entered the home straight, as you can see in the great jacket. Then when came under pressure, eventually dropped back and finished on third. Of four runners, the winner here was Dragon's Gold. Three is Almaraz. Almaraz is having its first start in the monsoon season so far. The run we are looking at is from the winter season in race number one hundred and thirty-five, where it was in sixth spot as they entered the home straight. Was running a little green as they entered the last two hundred meters. Was veering towards the inside. The jockey tried to get a grip, and eventually all it could do was finish on sixth of seven runners. The winner here was Sweet Legacy. Number five is Sea Dragon. Couple of starts for Sea Dragon in this season was a winner in the winter season in race number one and nineteen over here in the season. It started off with in fourth in race number one. In this race, it was in a forward position as they entered the last two hundred meters and tried to battle out, but all it could do was finish on second. The winner here was Rocket Man, who won that race by a widening margin of six and a quarter lengths. Number six is Ticker. Ticker. This is from race number thirteen, where Ticker was a little slowly out and uh, then was brushed up. Ticker was running as they entered the home straight. Was looking good for a while. Then Talame came up with a run down the center and took charge. And all Ticker could do was finish on third of six runners. The winner here was Talame. Moving on to the second race of the afternoon, the Bed Brick Seven Sprint Handicap for horses rated 41 to 66, rated 21 to 46, eligible to be run over a distance of 1,200 meters. We got four runners going to post for this one. The first runner we're looking at is number one, Long Lease. This is from the Calcutta Phillies Trial Stakes, where Long Lease was in third spot as they entered the home straight, then came up with a run and eventually finished on second. The winner here was Galacticus. Long Lease has earlier won three of his uh, four starts before it started in this race. Number two is Rodrigo. Rodrigo had a start after moving base from Western India in race number fifteen, where it went on a start to finish mission. Was in a forward position as they entered the last two hundred meters. Then uh, tried to battle on, but eventually could only finish on fourth. The winner here was Jal Lafed, who came up in the wide outset, took charge, and won that race by length and three quarters. Number three is Celtic Harlequin, earlier known as Agostini Karachi, has had couple of mock races in this uh, monsoon season. This run we are looking at from the winter season, where in race number one hundred fifty-nine, it was in eighth spot as they entered the home straight, came up wide of the track, then eventually finished on seventh. The winner here was Savvy Chick, who won that race by two and a quarter lengths. Number four is Indian Tiger. Couple of starts for Indian Tiger in this season. First up in race number twelve, it finished on fifth behind Good Tip over eleven hundred meters. Again, it traversed over eleven hundred meters in race number twenty-three, where it was in a forward position as they entered the home straight. Then into the last two hundred meters, tried to battle on, but in a bunch finish, finished on sixth of seven runners. The winner here was Mescal. Moving on to the third race of the afternoon, the Bed Brick Seven Live Sports Gaming Handicap for horses rated 41 to 66, rated 21 to 46, eligible to be run over a distance of 1400 meters. 
The first runner we are looking at is Mandolin. This start is from the monsoon season in race number 7 where Mandolin was in 2nd spot as they entered the home straight. Tried to make a race out of it but all it could do was finish on 2nd. Rimmel who was a runaway leader won that race eventually by 4 lengths and Mandolin finished on 2nd. Number 2 is Horus the Great X Pisa. This start is from race number 15 where Horus the Grace was in 4th uh, spot as they entered the home straight then uh, came up with a run and eventually finished on 2nd. The winner here was Jean Lafayette who came up with a late dash and took charge won that race. Number 3 is Burmese Multidimensional Lord of Skylight Express, the Mount of Suraj Naidu Burmese in race number 22 which was his first start in the Calcutta track. It was in second spot as they entered the home straight soon Suraj gave it the cue and took charge and then ran away from the field all tender heart could do was finish on second. Five and a quarter lengths was uh, the distance between Burmese and tender heart. Number 4 is Jawai. Jawai started in race number 8 and this season was in 2nd spot then Sun started to show out and won that race by beating Sweet Lady. Jawai is top class out of Kabini, the Mount of P. Trevor. Number 5 is Amalfitana. This run we are looking at is from the Hyderabad season in race number 107 where Amalfitana was a winner. Went on a start to finish mission, was uh, drifting out slightly of a straight course but eventually won that race by a 4 and a quarter lengths. Today ridden by Rupal Singh. Number 6 is Great Giver. This run is from the Hyderabad monsoon season in race number 118 where Great Giver was in forward position as they entered the last uh, 300 meters. Then uh, tried to fight on but all could uh, Great Giver could do was finish on second. The winner here was Maverick who won that race by a widening margin. We move on to the 4th race of the half in the bed break 7, 5 and a half. Handicap for horses rated 21 to 46, rated 1 to 26, eligible to be run over a distance of 1100 meters. First up, we got a couple of runners we are looking at. Number 1, Whistleblower. Number 3, East Side. This was in race number 15 where Whistleblower was in 5th spot as they entered the home straight when asked for an effort, didn't have much to offer, fell back and finished on 6th. Number 3, East Side was the winner in race number 11, it's uh, earlier start where it beat Lord Lucifer over here. East Side was travelling in 6th spot and uh, beat uh, one home and eventually finished on fifth. The winner was Jean Lafayette. Number two is Happy Soul. This is his first start after coming down from Hyderabad and race number 23 where Happy Soul uh, was in third spot then came up with a run down the center. But the winner Mescal came up with an even faster run on the outside and took charge and all Happy Soul could do was finish on a credible third behind Mescal. Number 4 is Impermanence. This was in race number 6 in the current season where Impermanence was in second spot as they entered the home street and tried to uh, kick on but then was a little flat footed and eventually finished turn 4th would definitely come out from this run. The winner here was good tip. Number 5 is Lord Lucifer. Couple of starts for Lord Lucifer. First up in race number 6, it finished on 5th behind good tip in race number 11. The one we are looking at, it was in a forward position as they entered the last 200 meters. Then there was a late charge by each side. They got into a ding dong battle for a few strides, but each side was always travelling a wee bit better, and Lord Lucifer could only finish second.
couple of runners we're looking at number six sporting trainer number nine asterisk sporting trainer already has had three stars first seven race number six it finished on six then in race number 11 it finished on fourth then this start it was traveling in fourth for most while then it came out and finished on third asterisk who had only start in this season in race number 21 was in second spot then uh gave up into the last 250 meters and eventually dropped back to second last the winner here was nautica Number 7, Dance Along. Dance Along had a win in race number 4 where it got the measure of Tropical Lady. Then it had a start in the Philly Trial Stakes where Dance Along was in second spot as they entered the home straight. But then there was uh, not much left in the tank into the last 200 meters and all Dance Along could do was finish on 4th uh, of 4th runners. The winner here was Galacticus. Number 8 is Italian Gold is a first starter for Italian Gold now in the monsoon season. This run we are looking at is from the winter season in race number 154 where it was in third spot as they entered the home street as you can see in a clustered finish and eventually finished on fourth. The winner here was Trebia who won that race by half a length. We move on to the fifth race of the year from the Bedbrick 7. Online handicap for horses rated 61 to 86, rated 41 to 866, eligible to be run over a distance of 1100 meters. First runner we are looking at is number one, Hidden Gold, who's already had three stars in this season. Its best start was in race number 14, where it finished on third behind True Marshall. In this race, it went on a start to finish mission, but into the last 200 meters, threw in the towel and eventually finished on 5th of 8 runners. The winner here was Stockbridge, who was rather impressive. Number 2 is Moselle, Rodrigo Connor out of Equine Lover. This is his first start now on the Calcutta track. This run we are looking at is from the Hyderabad season and raced in Mahar in 31, where it was in 2nd spot as they entered the home street, as you can see towards the inside in the red and white jacket. Eventually fell back and finished on second last. The winner here was Ashoka. Number 3 is Basharat. Couple of starts for Basharat in this season. Has a habit of getting out slowly out of the gates, then coming up with a big run and you know, the fag another race. This was no different in race number 14. It was in second spot in the home street as they entered. Then came up with a run, but all it could do was uh, bring down the margin to True Marshall and finished on second. Number four is Thousand Words. It's having its first start in the monsoon season. This run we are looking at is from the winter season in race number 159, where Thousand Words went on a forward position into the home straight, was in second spot, then started to slowly, gradually drop back through the field and eventually finished on eighth of ten runners. The winner here was Savvy Chick. Number 5 is Dr. Doom, has had a couple of starts first up in race number 3, it finished on 9th behind Galacticus in the next start. It was in 2nd spot as they entered the home street, this was in race number 23, then uh, came up with a run and looked threatening for a while but Mescal who came up with a late dash, there was no answer for Mescal's turn of foot and Dr. Doom could do next best thing was finish on 2nd. Couple of runners we are looking at. This is from the Hyderabad season. Silver Rita and Maktub they raced together and raced him in 99. Silver Rita was in a forward position into the last 200 meters and started to gradually drop back and eventually finished on 9th of 11 runners. Number 8 Maktub who was in 6th spot eventually dropped back to 7th and finished on there. The winner here was Ashwa Maroko. Number 7 is Good Tip, is looking to extend the winning run to 4 this time, has already won a couple of times in uh, Calcutta and once started had in Bangalore, it finished off in a win. This was in race number 12 where it was in second spot then took charge and started to really uh, show out and won that race by widening margin of 5 lengths beating Joel Effett into second.
We move on to the sixth race of the afternoon, the Bed Bricks 7 Calcutta Monsoon Cup. For horses 4 year old and over to be run over a distance of 2000 meters, we got 4 runners going to post for this one. The first runner is A Star Is Born. The run we are looking at is from Mysore in race number 55 where it was in 4th spot as they entered the home straight. Then tried to come up down the center and all it could do was finish on 3rd. The winner here was Ivaldo, won that race by 3 parts of a length. Number 2 is 3rd Avenue, Ampere out of Avant-Garde. Third Avenue, what a season it had in the Bangalore summer. A couple of wins in race number 78, where it went over 1800 meters and won, beating Rashpurin. The run we are looking at is from race number 160, where it was in third spot into the home straight, then took charge and won that race by three and a half lengths, beating La Reina. Number 3, Siege Perilous, who's had a couple of starts already in the Calcutta Monsoon season. First up in race number 5, it finished on 5th behind Delphine in race number 24. It was in the 7th spot as they entered the home straight, improved the position and eventually finished on 6th of 8 runners. The winner here was Stockbridge, who absolutely went away from them. Number 4 is Acrobat. Acrobat, uh, this run is his first start on the Calcutta Monsoon track in race number 25 after winning back to back races in Hyderabad. Acrobat was in second spot and kept on chasing uh, Sonata all the way down the winning straight, and uh, all it could do was uh, bring down the margin to about two and a quarter lengths, and uh, Acrobat finished on second. We move on to the big one, the Bed Brick 7 Calcutta Monsoon Derby 2023 Grade 2. For Indian horses, 3 year old only to be run over a distance of 2000 meters. This is the seventh race in the today's card. Three runners we look at. This is from the Coles Trial Stakes. We had 10 who was in a forward position, then started to drop back and eventually finished on fifth. Power Racer, who was racing in third spot, also dropped back and eventually finished on fourth. But the thriller came from Clifford who came up late and eventually won that race by a long neck, long neck. And Clifford today ridden by S. Zerwan, Power Racer by Vinay Jaiswal and 10 by S. Saklane. Number 2 is Destroyer. Destroyer had earlier finished on 3rd in the Bangalore Summer Derby behind Jamari. This one we are looking at is from the Coles Trial Stakes in Hyderabad where Destroyer was in 3rd spot, tried to make a race out of it but could only finish on 4th. The winner here was Huntington. Number 4 is Ramiel. This one we are looking at is from the Hyderabad season in race number 68 where it went over 2000 meters. Ramiel was in 3rd spot as they entered the home street. I tried to come up with a run but all it could do was finish on 5th of 10 runners. The winner here was Truth who was another runner in this race. And finally number 6 Truth. Truth won back-to-back -back races over 1600 meters and 2000 meters then was pitted into the derby where it was in 5th spot as they entered the home street and eventually came out and did the next best thing to synthesis and finish on 2nd, almost uh, 11 lengths behind the winner. That's your lineup for the derby. We moved on to the 8th and last race of the day, the Bed Brick 7 Mile Handicap for us is rated 21 to 46, rated 1 to 26 eligible to be run over a distance of 1600 meters. The first one I'll be looking at is Time. Time had a couple of starts in the Bangalore summer season. First up, it finished on second, then race number 72. And this start, it was installed the favorite, but it was in fourth spot as they entered the home straight. Said to gradually drop back and eventually finished on 8 of 14 runners. The winner here was King of War.
Number two is Ghost, who's had three stars in this season. First of it finished on fourth in race number two, then it again finished on fourth in race number eight. In the start in race number eight, it was in fourth spot, came up with the run, eventually finished on second. The winner here was uh, Dragon's Gold. Number 3 is Swift Lady. Only start for Swift Lady so far in this season was in race number 8 where it went over 1400 meters was in 3rd spot. Came up with a run down the center and eventually finished on 2nd. The winner here was Jawai. of runners we are looking at number four tender heart who's had three starts so far in this season first of it finished on fifth in race number two then again it finished on fifth in race number 11 in this race it finished on second the winner here was burmese and number eight was the spacecraft who was having his first start after coming down from southern india was in fifth spot stayed on in fifth about nine lengths from the winner Number 5 is Vinino. The start we are looking at is from the Hyderabad monsoon season in race number 110. When it came up with a very late run, was in uh, second last spot as they ended the home straight, then came up and finished on third. The winner here was Stunning Art. Number 6 is Thalame. Thalame, the start was from the current season in race number 13 where it was in 3rd spot then into the home street, took charge and won that race very comfortably beating Reagan into 2nd. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. See you at the races.